Next case on the docket, uh, on social media, sometimes you experience a person getting in your inbox or hopping in your DM, is, is the term is said. And you might have one of these people. Hi, babe. You see me ask you who you? Girl, y'all be thinking that somebody be after y'all for real. I just be trying to be your friend. Shit, you ain't no mean now. You better start writing back. Yo, stink ass. First of all, before I get to him, anybody else who does this, I mean, we need you to dial it back down a little bit. We need you to dial it down. Everybody ain't got the response to you just because you were in their DMs. I don't care whether it's a man or a woman or whatever. I don't have to respond to you, especially if I don't know you. So that's the first violation here. The second violation is the fact that, sir, your face is aggressive. That may be one of the reasons. Not, not aggressive looking like you're angry, but your face is aggressive. Uh, it, it's an aggressive face. You got the type of face that a step on your shoe at the club, sir. You got the type of you type you got the type of uh, face that skips people in the line at amusement parks. You have an aggressive face, sir. Not only is your face aggressive, your mouth is aggressive. Right there, look look at your teeth. Your teeth are aggressive. They so aggressive that they rolling up on other teeth. That's why no teeth is in its own place because your teeth are aggressive and rolling up on other teeth. You have a, you got a East Coast versus West Coast war taking place in your mouth. And you're wondering why this woman is not responding. I know why you did it, because you probably heard it goes down in the DM. But sir, it don't go down in the DM for you. It, it don't. Because you might be, you might have created this fantasy person in your head of how you are and what you are online, but this woman is not responding to you because in real life, she see you. You ain't sneaking up on nobody. We know you, we she we know you, she know you. And I and I, this woman, and you're probably in the inbox of women that are way outside your parents. You're probably in the inbox of women who you probably shouldn't be in their inboxes, sir. Because I'm telling you, a woman who's a dime piece, a 10, don't want to date the dude that, with the head shaped like Roger from American Dad. They don't. They don't want your bubble head ass. So, sir, what I want you to do is stay out these women inboxes. I want you to, to, to find you a nice uh, woman with a sparkling personality who also has an aggressive face. And y'all go out here and get together and y'all make some pretty babies. And I know people are like, well, why laugh? Why, why you say they're gonna make pretty babies? Because if he ugly and she ugly, basic mathematics say two negatives equal a positive. That's why two ugly people have beautiful kids, because two negatives equal a positive. It's simple math right there. I need y'all to get caught up on your algebra, because that that is that is point blank, that's it. Two negatives equal a positive. And I'm positive, sir, that you're way too unattractive to be just jumping in women's DMs. So, sir, I find you guilty of scaring women. Yeah, not scaring them off, but scaring them like you're going to hurt them, but you scare them because when they open their inbox and they see your face, they like, damn, is this the type of dude that I am attracted? So, sir, I find you guilty of scaring women. I find you guilty of needing a dental appointment. I also find you guilty of being in the DM, but where you really need to be is at the dentist. Next case. Seems like that was the last case on the docket for the day, so there's no further business for the court. Bailiff, we can adjourn.